Oh, that's fancy, isn't it? Look at that. Good evening, Jills fans. Welcome to a fast filling up men's Priestfield Stadium for another match day live from Jills and Blood TV. I'm joined by Stocky and Boz in the build up to Gillingham versus a very strong West Ham side, isn't it, boys? Um, just had a look at the team lose for the uh, two sides, and we've made one change. Mika Mandron misses out because he's become a father, so congratulations to Mika. Yeah. Alex Jakubiak comes in, but I think the bigger lose is, is their team, isn't it? Yeah. That pretty much looks like their first 11. Yeah, we thought they might change a few. We expected Roberto in goal, to be honest. I think we were hoping for Roberto in goal. Yeah, I think we was, considering we've seen a few of his highlights, if you can yeah. call it that, on Match of the Day this season. But, um, yeah, very strong, but it's what Evans wanted. It's what I personally want as well. I think we can take the game to them wherever they're playing West Ham. We're banging form at the moment, and I can't see us losing. Oh, I think we lose. And I think that just about sums up the atmosphere at the club at the moment, the way that we've been playing, the fact that a lot of fans, you said earlier as well, Boz, on Twitter are positive on that today. Whereas I think a few years ago, they would have been hoping more in, um, you know, rather than it being a re realistic thing. So... Well, you know, the not the end of the world, is it? No, no, it's not, not at all. And the thing is, regardless of the form we're in and the form they're in, and our 11 and their 11, it's a free swing, isn't it? They're the Premier League team. They come here under all the pressure to, get, to do a job. We get beat, we get beaten so big and we go back to League One next weekend. But I think they might have to be slightly from their best, but I think the first goal will be massive. I think we just need to, it's a bit cliche, give it our all, put 110 in, attack the uh, full backs, get Hanlon running up. Andy Kubiak. Andy Kubiak, whip the crowd up and see what happens. That's it, yeah, it's going to be a full house in here, isn't it? So it's got to be a good atmosphere. Right, we've all spoken about team moves and other stuff. Important thing, Boz, score prediction. 1-0, Ollie's in. I don't know if I can do score prediction. All I'm saying is we're not going to lose. We will go with 1-1. One, one. I'm like you, I think I'm torn between Art and Ed. Head says 1-0. Art says Jill's pinch it by the odd goal. Alex Alex, I'll go Alex to Kubiak and if it goes 2-1 Brandon and them to score the winner and the roof to come off the rain and then. Anyway, we should bring you more footage as and when we get it. I'm not yet out warming up apart from a couple of goalkeepers, so as soon as they are out we should have a look and bring you more footage. Joined by Glenn, familiar face on the channel now. How are you, mate? Looking forward to this one, aren't you? I've been looking forward to it for a long, long time, buddy. And uh, the day's gone very slowly, to be fair. It has dragged but, a bit uh, today, it, to be yeah. fair, but we're nearly there. We are, we are. And I, and obviously, I can't be playing these days, mate, so it's gone really, really slowly. Nothing, <laughs> nothing in between, really. So, oh, no, I had a morning no, game no. to watch, thankfully, so that helps a little bit. Stocky was found wandering aimlessly around the supermarket about three o'clock this afternoon. <laughs> brilliant. <laughs> brilliant, absolutely brilliant. What do you think? Team news, what are we thinking? Well, I'll be honest, Kieran picked it. I wasn't aware that, uh, of the family, uh, the good news that Man we've had from Mandron. Um, but Kieran picked before he could do that, he was going to be one change. And Mandron wasn't going to be playing. So, I associate you've done it right. Um, I think it's a great pick. The, Evans is stuck with the faithful. And uh, let's see what happens. And let's be fair, Moyes has picked a very strong team for this fixture. We just said West Ham have gone yeah. pretty much first 11, it Absolutely. looks like. He, so. he wants to win this game. Um, desperately, it's only his second game in charge, and I'm sure that when he looked at the offensive this when he took over, he probably didn't fancy this too much, so he's not taking any chances to be fair to But, like we've all said, I think before we've come on here, we just spoke with the Stoppy and Boz and everyone else, and they've said it's a free swing, it makes no odds to us what their form is, what their 11 is, it's about us, yeah. and all the pressure's on them, isn't it? Absolutely. They're the Premier League side, so they're the ones that are expected to get a result here this afternoon. Yeah. And so even Cardiff, when they came down here last, you know, last year, probably to the day actually, a year ago. It is, yeah. Um, yeah, uh, let's be quite honest, they still should have beaten us, 
regardless of what their Premier League form was like. I mean, we were, we're actually worse then. I think we were flying 18 or 19. Yeah, we're in a lot better form now. Um, but, you know, it's a free swing for us. We come here to enjoy it. Win, lose or draw tonight yeah. is going to be a great night. And these are the occasions we live for. Trips to Accrington, Oxford, Doncaster, Coventry. It's all worth it being a Jill's fan and being here tonight with us. Right, and you've said win, lose or draw. Then you know what the last question is before we let you go and so uh, soak up the atmosphere. Score prediction. Well, Kieran says one all, Hamlin. And you know what, I quite fancy this for a replay, but I think it's going to be two all. And I think Hamlin's going to cause all kinds of problems this evening, regardless if they've got on their team sheet. He just needs to play freely. Same way that he does all the time. Absolutely, freely. And, and you know, with, with, with gusto and pace. And I think he can get two tonight. So we've got, so you've got two draws. Yep. I've said, Head says draw. Oz has gone 1-0. Stocky went. Go draw, Stock. Oh, yeah. yeah, Stocky went 1-0 yeah. as well. Yeah. Yep. So, plenty of positivity in here as the uh, atmosphere starts to build. Yeah, it's, mate, it's, Wee, just, it's going to be a great night. Let's be honest, these nights don't come along too often for us. Let's, I'm going to just enjoy it, have a great time. Sit and see what happens. I think 90 minutes is just going to be singing all along. Whatever happens, everyone's going to be behind this team. Um, and let's see. I'll, I look forward to your after match one. Yeah, see, see how it goes. Enjoy it. Thank you, buddy. Relax, Brandon, relax.
bit the front man. Can you put a lot of colour? Where's that going? I can't see, there's no respect. Max, where's that going? Oh, he's got no whip. On Barry. Put it back in a mixer. Uh, I've got it clear again. Right start though. Good pressure early on. That's it, yeah. Exactly, yeah. Don't let them set. Second call in the first five minutes here. Well, we think we can't see the uh, scoreboard today because we've moved slightly. Wally Lee's delivery's got to be better though. Yeah, it is. A bit deeper. Where's that gone? It's gone out the far side. Get it back sure, O'Keefe's oh, done well. Go on, Max. Where's that gone? Oh, oh, another corner, I think. Come on, Gilles! Oh, long throw. Oh, it's got to be. How dare we do such things? <laughs> Come on, Connor. Wind it up. Win the first one. Get it back in the mixer. Get it back in the mixer. Oh, Barry to pull us out of poor touch. Now we're in trouble. Oh, they're away here, Anderson. Go on, Jack. Well, yeah, Jack. Yeah, Jack. That sucker will settle down though, will he, after that? Done really well then. Another chance, another set piece. Foul on Stuart O'Keefe for it. Thomas O'Connor's oh, launched one. Deep, that one. Over the far post. Back. He's done well. Oh, I thought that was dropping from that. Another, another rush clearance for them though. The yeah. back, the back three don't look like they've settled at all, do they? Stay with this. Yeah, exactly. Just keep putting them under pressure. Come on, Connor. Stay yeah, yeah, this one's good as I remember. Come on. It's a corner again. Yeah. Gotta make one of these count deals, have we? Come on! <laughs> you want to put one of these right under Fabianski, don't you? If he was yeah. struggling in a week with an injury. They're gonna break. Should come all the way over to Jack Bonham, yeah. yeah. So it's more about our start. Jack Bonham's gonna live from time to get him. Who's that still up there? Is that Max still up there? Right, now we can settle and get our shape back. Still nil nil, six or seven play. Like this corner number four or five at least here, Scott. We've only played 12 for uh, eight minutes. Can we make one count? Oh, oh, I just need someone to edit in. Going out the far side, we know what's coming. They can't deal with it at the moment, can they? Really good, really bright. He just wants to create a chance. Exactly, yeah. No time at all, exactly. Come on, Connor. Different. Max has gone back to him. Go on, Barry. Good delivery. Oh, took too long. He just launched this one. I don't mind us mixing it up, though. Connor's winding this one up. We're on top, territorially. About 14 plays, still going on. No chance here, stop. Holly Lee, is there a case for a card or did he even get booked? I don't think he did. Holly looked like he wriggled free and the bloke's just pulling his shirt and pulling down. This is a real good chance, probably what, 25 yards out the far end? Holly Lee and Tom O'Connor. Probably suits O'Connor more, doesn't it? I think we just did this, I don't think we tried really. Go on, Tom, always the change. Still there, still alive, There's a lot of colours he's on. He's gone oh, oh, straight down the keeper's front. Oh, he's going to get the shoot. They are rattled. They are rattled. That's a foul. What's that mean for the back of him? Six of the best for Gillingham there. Six corners earned already. 20, 20 minutes or so played. Hamden calls him absolutely loads of fun. Another poor one. Where's it gone? Oh, oh, oh it's nearly gone in. Where's that gone? It's broke to Hamden. Oh, it's gone on the edge. Yes. Oh, oh, yeah. Fabianski spell on it. Right, yeah. We're knocking oh, on the door, aren't we? Yeah, Fabianski. If we hit a post, I weren't sure what happened. It's miles away, but it's an awful call. <laughs> Well, they look rushed and harried and uncomfortable defensively. Oh, 
This is a proper cup tie. David Vega live, you've got to love it. First real chance here for the Amherst boys. Max Aim, I'll chat Tucker and talk to each other, did they? Left it to each other and then Jack at Oh, was it? Uh, Amar ended up uh, tugging Haller's shirt, didn't he? Linesman didn't flag. Referee gave it from the blind side. They've got to cut the threats here, don't they? Lanzini and Snodgrass over this. This would be a kick in the teeth. Get up, Brandon. Well done. On, then, we, break. we break. We break. We break. Go on, Alex. Go on, Alex. Throwing just inside their half. Chance to the box with another free kick right on the far touch line. At 15 yards from the corner flag. Right, just overdoing it or underdoing yeah. it at the moment, haven't we? It's only been one that's been the front of the keeper so far, isn't it? Still goalless with what? Just under 15 minutes to play till the half time was first corner to defend here and it stopped. Yeah, they've just gone on the right hand side, didn't they? Who's so, That's dangerous. Where's that gone? Oh, we've got a lot. That's how it to get it. Come on, Chill! And the ball! Kubak's away if he misses that, isn't he? Still nil nil, not long half time. Yeah, he's there. That's a push! He's got it. Get out of his soft leg. Go on, Brandon. Come on. Oh, scuffed it. Oh, he scuffed it a bit more, Amar. Oh, Half the chance for Conor Amar, he scuffed it through to Fabianski. Breaking on the right now. Managed to get back into the position. It was a run, Snodgrass. Snodgrass has got away from Amar with it. Forced them back again really well, though. They've had to go all the way home in. Everything's in front of us, still goalless for about seven minutes left. Free kick to defend here, but for me, they're led by. Yeah. Right, Keith made no motion towards him when he fell over and the referee fell for it. He's gone very near. Is that really cute, or did he just miss kick it? It looks as if a very bad miss kick, but nearly cut off. Who's it made the run? Anderson, but we've managed to get it clear for a throw in again. Stay with us a sec. That's just said it. They'll be the ones that will be up here at the break. This is new now. Oh, yeah. Like you say, we can't switch off here at all. Like can't let him shoot. Can't let him shoot. Now we've got a deep in here. He's the one trying to dictate the flat at the moment. Stay here. Snodgrass. Snodgrass. Stay on him up. He knows he's going to get back on his left. Well done, Tom. Stay with him. Stay with him. Yeah, well done. Full stun back. Full stun back. Well done. Here we go. Great. Great. Good, Alex Kubiak. Exactly, yeah. Not got one. Soft. Oh, that was unlucky there. Now we need to get back in. Stay with this a second again. Scott and on the halfway line. They've been backwards again, though, haven't they? A lot of their football, they've had it square and back. That's what they've had, haven't it? So they've got another injury here. The game's been stopped. It's Frederick's. Bless him. It's not being looked after. It's like in the pampered world of the Premier League. time here in the Priestfield, it's Gillingham, Neil West Ham United, Neil Boss didn't really get a chance to speak during the game, he's quite loud and I probably couldn't have heard it from two seats away, such is the atmosphere, but you've got to be impressed with that, haven't you? Yeah. Defensively they look rushed when we get the ball into Jakubiak or Hanlon, Hanlon's absolutely terrifying and for me as soon as he gets the ball at his feet, um, I think Jack Tucker settled really good. He missed his first header, didn't he, against Hallow, and he settled after that really well. And I think we've been better than them, to put it bluntly. Jack Warner's not made a save, he's not had to make a save. Something like that, yeah, and he's come and claimed to cut the corners or crosses, and I think that's about it. But in terms of work rate, desire, Wanting to get this done, I think I, I wasn't sure. I thought it was post stop. He said Fabian actually got down and shoveled it around the court for the post for a corner, but or out safety. But I think in terms of his R and work rate, we've been a lot better than him. I think the longer this goes on, the more it'll part their mind about Oxford, Wimbledon. 
I said to Stoppy and you, I think just before um, the half time whistle, I said, Would you be tempted to maybe sacrifice a central midfielder and change the diamond to a three and get Marshall just to go and stand on his other letter? Not yet. Because he's had to come on, and he. I don't mean now, I mean with 20 minutes to go, if it's still nil nil. I don't think Jolly would be one today because of the fact that he's the only striker on the bench. But we've got Regan Charles, Cook as well as Matty Willock. He is alive. But yeah, in terms of what we wanted, and that was to be in the game at half time, we've done that, haven't we? We've been really good. We've worked harder than them. We've wanted it more than them. And can we just. Yeah, I'm not sure it's a system they play all the time at back three, but. Can we just find that bit of quality to maybe prize them open and, and score the first goal? Holly yeah. Lee's been very good. Eh? Tom O'Connor's been absolutely superb as well. But to a man, we've been absolutely brilliant. Yeah, I think everyone's been really, really good. There's not anyone that's dropped off. It's obviously, you know, against these, we cannot switch off for a second because if they get a chance, the chance not going. We have one, sorry. Yeah. Yeah, we did have one where we switched off, sorry, didn't we? The one with Fuller and uh, it was either Ogilvy or Tucker. They didn't talk, and then um, Amar had to pull down um, Felipe Anderson, I think it was. But the free kick was appalling. It was an atrocious free kick. I sent the stop you during the game, but set pieces have not been good from either side. But, but it's up to us now, isn't it? Yeah, we can bit of someone here who can write their name on the back page of every paper tomorrow. And I think I've just won the match day lottery, so <laughs> First real chance in West Ham stop you, wasn't it? Um long ball over the top. Jack Tucker got something on it but not enough, yeah. Got him with his legs with it, I think. West Ham have started this half well though, they? So they managed to hit the target, yeah. They've, they've been better than us, though, haven't they, since the restart. They might have got to rock it up their backside at half time. Oh, yeah, I see that get blued over. We was walking back from. Oh, really? Yeah, potentially. He's done well, he's won a throw in as well. We just need to settle down here, start this period. Chance here again, isn't there? Brandon Allen winning another free kick. Copy and paste that phrase, I think. It's about 30 yards here, and it's only Lee. It's just going to be a little clip into the danger area, isn't it? On his own back, now Amos, two on their own at the back. Go on, Connor. Oh, he's won it. Back in the middle. Jones, go on. Fabi oh. actually reacted a bit quicker than Brandon Anders, but we just need to keep the ball for a few seconds here, or a minute or so, don't we? They've gone long again. Hello. Jack Tucker's done well. He's been fouled, surely. Done well there. Kubiak's done well. Keep hold of that. Kubiak's done brilliantly. Go on, Jules. Go on, Alfie Jones. Just give it some round him. Get someone round him. Ah, he just got stuck under his feet. They pinched it. Pecker and Rice smashed it clear. Tuck. He's just getting isolated with Hal Air at the moment, and he, yeah, but he's done well again. I don't want him to be constantly isolated though. The game suddenly seems more stretched, doesn't it? Where's that gone? Max Amos pinched it. He's done well. He's giving it away. Just need to settle. Just need to settle. That's right, saying where shootables are, and their shootables there packed in the all, aren't they? Suck has cleared it, but everything's a little last ditch at the moment. Oh. Bash it clean. Yeah, we finally got it clear to a degree. Oh. Should have now the break. Oh, we just held on to it too long, didn't we? But yeah, definitely free kick on the halfway. Yeah. Connor's going to wind another long throw up. It's time that he's flicked. Has it gone back to him? They're going to smuggle it clear again. Yeah, he's got away oh, with that. Yeah. Turned into a really good ball. Alfie Jones, that is brilliant. He's just done it. Who's this lad? That? Is this Masaka? Masaka, this side, he keeps getting a lot of space. Number 26. Jack's up here, going to have to get there. Easy for Jack Bonham. Half time, I set the buzz out. 
final man out to do anything. They, they've not got him behind us first off. They've got him behind us two or three times already this period, haven't they? So. Yeah. yeah, we just want us to be a little tighter at the moment, but... That's a bit of a race. Still goalless. West Ham screaming penalty, aren't they? I mean, we're at the wrong end, but... Oh, I thought they was appealing for a pull on his shirt. We're miles away, yeah, but they're well on top, aren't they? Yeah. Would you make a change to maybe just try and switch it up and give them something different to think about? Yeah, potentially. Marshall's come on the last few weeks and done well. Yeah. At the moment, you don't want to... Really Jakubiak's had one of them performances again where he started and not been in the game, hasn't he? It's, a, it's hard for him and Allen though, because you know, the service again obviously isn't great. Yeah. Um, oh, oh, yeah. He's bad, yeah. No, he's not been poor, he's just not had a lot of the ball, unfortunately. Yeah, just need to get him to it and give it to him more, yeah. Let's have a letter, he's just dug one out here. Down at the far end, still nil nil with about what an hour gone. Potentially. <laughs> West Ham lead one nil and it's Pablo Zabaleta, but maybe not the most first choice one you think in terms of the goal score, but yeah, you're right, it has been coming, isn't it? But We've got a gamble now, haven't we? We might as well sacrifice the defensive if we don't have a right go. It's still only one, isn't it? I've chopped Marshall on as well. And have a real go. I'd rather lose 2 0 than just trying to settle for this. Exactly. It's up to us now. Come on, Jill. Still in this, aren't we? Come on, Jill. Win the first one. Where's that one? Only Lee. Oh, they're going to break. They've not looked that likely up with this half, no. unfortunately. They've been, they've looked like the Premier League team, haven't they? Yeah. yeah. And suddenly we just look a little bit tired. I'm sure Oak has done well there to be fair to hold that. Is that the Mus Muswark or what is he doing? Yeah, he's been quality. Jack Bonham, where's he gone? He's got caught in no man's land. That's brilliant defending. The trouble is Jakubiak's now playing as a midfielder and we've only got one up top I and mean, then every time it comes out it just comes back. Mark Marshall's ready to come on. Charles Cook's ready to come on and all. Yeah, they're both stripped and ready for action. But... They're now booking for diving and all that. They're booking for that as well. That's cheating. That's blatant cheating, isn't it? He's got to be booked for the dive and he's got to be booked for Two separate offences. Cheat! 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 It is cheating, isn't it? Rightly booked from diving or chucking a ball away or whatever. Right, I mean, a proper soul. Shkubiak. Charles Cook and Marshall from the sides then. Don't mind it, we're having a go. Yeah. Yeah. Corner for Jules, yeah. she might be out of tell. Come on. One magic no. Come on, Ollie Lee. Come on, Jules. Where's that gone? Tracks up. Come on, Yes! Oh. Oh. Took a slight nick, didn't it? Slowed it down. Yeah, I think it did. Uh, yeah, he wanted the wrong foot in, didn't he? But still in this all the time. It's just one. Under the final ten minutes here, chance for Jules to load the box from another long throw. So Max has got three round him. Look. Ah, oh, what? It's getting frustrating, isn't it? Someone else is coming on. Someone else. Uh, and Jolly, yeah. Willock's out here with Pringle still, so final throw of the dice is, is imminent, it looks like. Still trying, still going to the death of Wayne. Come on, Marshall, good delivery. That goes box. Come on, another corner, another corner to Gillingham. Still in this. Come on, come on, come on. Yes, come on, Jules. Still in this. Come on, come on, come on. Another corner, come on, Ollie Lee. 
There's more up in there. Don't foul him. Don't foul him, Max. That's all right, Miles Marshall's picked that up. Go on, Marshy. He's done really well, Ken. Okay. That's all right, that's fine. He's got no option. Stay on side. Go on, Connor, get up. Go on, Connor. He's won it. Come on, Conor Ogilvy. Goes back. It's got to be good delivery. Four minutes. What's that say? Ten four. What's that say? It's got two numbers on it. Four and two numbers on it. I don't know what that was. Get a ten and a four. I don't know what that is. Four additional minutes. Can you time it? Free kick on the halfway line. It's got to go, box. Here it comes. It's not right. He's won everything on Bonner, and he's been superb in fairness to him. But still a couple of minutes. Come on, Jules. Yeah, I don't think he's not one ahead, to be fair to him. Ball's in the wrong half from our perspective, unfortunately. Philip A. Anderson's got it. I've got space on the right now, is that four now? Sit down. Danger here, can we get that? Let's have a little. Where's the tent? What's going on now? Keep it, don't just bang it because it needs to go. It's gone again. Come on, Brandon. Brandon, 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 That's a foul, surely. It's going to have to just load it. Can we send Jack as well? I'll send Jack Bonham and all. Why not? It's about a minute left. I don't understand what people are doing earlier. It's ridiculous. We're still in the game. It's not like we're 4 0 down. It's not a bad ball. Oh, oh Charles Cook. I don't even know who's coming. The flag stayed down. He's one on one if he controls it. Come on, Jules. Yeah, it's now or never for us, unfortunately. Come on, got to win the first one. It's too easy again. Alfie Jones has done well. He's got to go box. Mm -hmm. Stuart O'Keefe's keeps on it. Go on, Alfie Jones. Oh, 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 no, nah, they've broken here. Jack Tucker's going to have to get there. Uh, it could be two. Oh, Hallett. Jack Tucker's done brilliantly. Damn. Lucas Fabianski celebrates like they won the Champions League. Yeah, well done for beating Little League One Gilligan, mate. That's really good. Uh, game over, unfortunately.